Let's see which fraction is larger, 7 eighths or 15 sixteenths. So you could try to reason this out, or you could use a calculator. 7 divided by 8 would give you a decimal. 15 divided by 16 gives you a decimal. You could compare them, see which is larger, 7 eighths or 15 sixteenths. The other way to do it is find a common denominator. Right now we have 8 and 16. But if these were the same, we could just compare the numerators and we'd be done. Let's multiply 8 times 2. Because 8 times 2, that's 16. Down here we already have 16. Let's keep this the same, 15 sixteenths. And since we multiplied 8 times 2 here, we do need to multiply the numerator times 2 as well. 2 over 2, that equals 1. So we're just multiplying this by 1. doesn't change the value, just the way it's written. 7 times 2 is 14. And now these are equivalent fractions, the same value. And we can compare because we have the same denominator. 15 is greater than 14. 15 sixteenths is greater than 14 sixteenths. These are equivalent, right? So 15 sixteenths is also greater than 7 eighths. Only by 1 sixteenth. Not a lot, but it's still greater. This is Dr. B. Thanks for watching.